First of all, just what was the road back? Uh, road right back. Here? So it was a tough one. Um, obviously, I've been dealing with this since national national team camp. Come back three days into preseason. So it's been a long couple months, obviously, with some a lot of disappointments. You know, a couple of times I, I felt like I was back and then had a little setback. So it, it feels good getting these couple of games under my belt and um, having the 90 minutes on, on the weekend felt felt really good. Um, fitness obviously can always improve. It's going to continue the next couple of games. But um, it felt good to just have the full 90. And after that long period out, it was just nice being back out on the field. All right, going back a little bit, um, you got a few minutes in the opener. Yeah. Uh, you know, a long time coming for the stadium and whatnot. Your initial feeling just getting, just being able to play in that game. Yeah, that was really, really special for me. Um, not only because I was out so long and that was my first game back, but also the whole uh, last call at RFK from last season and mm -hmm. the, the build up for the club, the organiz organization, uh, fans and stuff going into Audi Field. So being out there, um, Pretty unbelievable feeling for me. All right, for you to talk about what you rehab, getting your timing back, you just started this past week. Yeah. How's it feel out there for you? Man? It felt good actually. Um, mentally, I had to stay strong the whole game because my legs did, you know, feel. I felt them a little bit, but I mean, um, I stayed sharp. I think throughout the game, it's always there's that little timing every once in a while, right, where I need to get back. But I think overall, I was pretty happy with my performance on the weekend. I know a lot of times when athletes come back from injuries, a lot of times they talk about. More so being physical, just mental, and you know the way yeah. that you know you take on a lot of challenges. Yeah. When did that kind of all the way go out your mind? Um, you didn't think about it at all. I think uh, you know after the first game, I kind of getting back in. You had to get used to the pace a little bit. That's always the case. But after that, um, I felt pretty good. Got stuck in a couple of times in training. Knew knew I didn't have a problem with it. And when the game starts, whistle blows. It's full on, and I just kind of play play my heart out. Um, you guys have been creating a lot of quality chances over the past couple of weeks. Yeah. I haven't finished all of them. Um, just from your position on the field, what, do you, is there a reason for the uptick in the chances you guys are creating? Or is it just coming with, I mean, just gelling? Yeah, I mean, I think it's uh, gelling's obviously one of the important aspects. Uh, we got Wayne obviously coming in who has who's new to the team, just finding guys' rhythm and how, how they play. But also it's, you know, a lot of the work off the ball as well. Off the ball meaning defensively. Winning balls, playing forward quick, getting opponents out of position, and, and getting those chances. So hopefully we can convert them. We're creating a lot of chances, which is always positive. We need to convert them to keep um, producing goals and obviously lead to the three points. All right. Last thing you already mentioned, Wayne, um, the games in which you came on, you know, late in the game and last week yeah. you started. What's his impact been both from you from watching and being on the field with him? Great player. Um, for me personally, I feel like he's always in a good spot. Mm -hmm. You can always find him. You can tell he's an experienced guy, wants to help the team, um, good teammate as well. So it's, it's nice to have him here um, and be a part of the team.